Hello and welcome to the ORCAD X Capture series. This video demonstrates how to connect a bus in ORCAD X Capture. A bus wire is a vector, multiple bit wire, used to graphically bundle a group of scalar, single bit wires together. You can draw a bus using the place bus icon, or by selecting place and then clicking on bus, or by pressing the B shortcut key. Click on the starting point to begin drawing the bus, and use the shift key to bend it. Please note that the bus will appear graphically thicker than a regular wire. To assign a name to the bus, click on the place net alias icon and specify the bus name and bit range. It's important to note that there are two specific syntaxes for naming the bus bit range. Therefore, maintaining a consistent naming convention is crucial. After naming the bus, it's time to connect it to the wires. Use the place bus entry icon or choose place. Click on bus entry to connect the wire to the bus bit by bit. Now, the wires are connected to the bus. Alternatively, you can select and right click on the wire, click connect bus, and then select the wire. And tap on the bus you want to connect to. Specify the bus net name and bit range, and similarly, specify the other bus bits. You can also use the auto connect feature. Click on the auto connect to bus icon, or choose place, auto wire, click connect to bus. Press and hold the control key, then select the multiple component pins. And tap on the bus you want to connect to. Specify the bus net name and bit range. Click OK to connect the pins to the bus. Please note that the net name range is always distributed from top to bottom or left to right and is not affected by the order in which you select the pins. That's all the time we have now for this video. To learn more about the ORCAD X Capture tool, click the link below and enroll for free courses on the Cadence Support Portal. Thanks for watching.